All right, all right. What up, y'all? Shit, it's one twelve in the morning. I get done at midnight every night. I work nine minutes away. Come home, hop in the shower, get something to eat, crank out a video while I roll up my nighttime joint. But I'm going to keep it a stack. It is below zero out in Jersey right now. We done got the second junk car that I used to smoke in. That was just parked and abandoned in our parking lot. That was ours, but it ain't drive no more. We got that shit towed. I sold it to my aunt. That shit's towed out of here, so I can't sit in there and smoke no more. So I got to, you know what I mean, go outside. Old school with it. I mean, I got a six-month-old baby amongst an eight-year-old, a 12-year-old, and a 15-year-old sophomore girl in high school so i can't burn in the crib no more i can't burn in a car neither it's a brand new car the baby rides in it like but i got a little something i want to review bring to the table show y'all this is what i've been smoking it's about done now this is a friendly farms wedding cake and it it did its thing for me i was very 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 happy with this cartridge very happy wedding cake family uh, uh uh friendly forms is a uh a good company always but to have great strands with a great company i guess without a great company you can't have great strands but you get what i'm saying man like I was very pleased here with this wedding cake. You see what's left in it. Not much all the way around. Not much all the way around. I had it on the charger while I was in the shower. Because I planned on doing this. I got pens out the wazoo, chargers plugged up all over the house, so I could go to any corner of my house and there's a fucking pen on a charger block charging for carts. And I ain't even a big cart smoker. I'm really a flower smoker, honestly. It's just I don't have a place to smoke my flower right now, so cartridges are really what's um, convenient for me at this time. Don't get it wrong whatsoever. I get my flower in every morning, every night, whenever I want, but just a lot less now because I'm on the cart twist. Mentioned these the other day. Rove carts, man, these things are fire. The company is called Rove. And this is Rove Glue, it's a hybrid. I already now, this is my third one. Uh, out of this pack, I got, I had Rove OG. It's good for insomnia, good for pain, good for um having a hard time eating, bad appetite. It helps with that. And then I had the Rove Kush. These are all Indica Dominance, the OG and the Kush Roves. Back to back days, one day I finished the OG, the next day I opened the Kush, finished that, and now I'm on to the glue hybrid. This is the only last Rove I could smoke because the rest are sativas. The Rove, anyways, I got plenty of other different companies. You know, if you watch me and follow my videos and my YouTube, you'll see how I get down with the marijuana. I'm in a legal state, a weed, a, a recreationally weed legal state in New Jersey. Uh, so everything you see here on my channel is legal. I'm doing nothing at all legal. Um, I'm always at all times under the legal limit uh, of carrying marijuana and having marijuana in my possession. But uh, everything I do when it comes to marijuana that you see on my channel is legal. I live in New Jersey. We are coming up on a year recreationally legal. So. 
<coughs> don't trip for me. Don't trip out on me. This is what I take pride in. I'm a connoisseur. It's what I love to do. I'm a legal state. Why not talk about it? Why not enlighten people about it? Why not put other weed smokers? You know, weed is the bring, bring, bring each other together plant. Like, weed brings people together. So it's like, why wouldn't I bring great products to the internet to show people that might not have heard of it before and can indulge and go grab it, go try it? Find out for yourself that I'm not a bullshit. I don't bullshit. I give real live 110%. When I do do a review, it's real live in your face. I read up on my shit. I do my homework on my strands. Like, I know my shit. You know what I mean? Glue hybrid rove right here. The OG and the Kush put me down, bro. Put me down. They were indica dominance and they put me down. They really helped with insomnia. And pain, and you always had the munchies. This here helps with. It's very euphoric. It's very relaxing. I'm trying to remember. I just read it like a half hour ago before I got in the shower. It's good for insomnia and it's good for pain. So insomnia, pain. Euphoria. And relaxation. And the first two cards that I've looked up, the OG and the Kush, and I've read and done my homework on, everything they said it touches effects-wise, boy, it touched. It did. Like, these ain't to be played with right here. This is relaxation, euphoria, insomnia, and pain. Without further ado, let's see what she looks like. And then, my favorite part. See what she tastes like. The smoke looks like. And after a good amount of time smoking with y'all, I could then hopefully tell y'all how I feel. Man, they package these things like you wouldn't believe. Right on though, cause kids are a trip nowadays. But like, ain't no kid getting into these motherfuckers. They got a safety and everything. When you gotta push this safety, bang, and then push that up. So it's like, push, push. See how it popped up and out. And then inside you got your cart. There's the paper down there. I was gonna say the other one came with real rewards. Full gram glue cart. I like that it's a turquoise blue, it's pretty lit. And I love the mouthpiece on this. It's just a big, wide open mouthpiece. Unlike this type of mouthpiece, you know, your standard, regular, little comfy lip mouthpiece, recorder mouthpiece. I like to call reminds me of a recorder. You remember, uh, elementary school, uh, music class. Get the cap off. I love, absolutely love the tops to these, man. They rip for real. They rip. Rove glue. Clean as can be. Fresh out the box. Full gram. Can we get the rewards out for y'all easy enough to see what it says for you? Rove Rewards, scan authentic, get hooked up. Download app at rovebrand.com slash rewards. Peel the Rove Rewards sticker on the bottom of the box. Open Rove Rewards app and scan QR code. I read this and actually saved it uh, yesterday on the, the other one I opened. 
Bella G, but I ain't do it. Use. Your cartridge is pre-primed. Do not preheat. Steady hits of five seconds or less are ideal for optimal continued performance. Care. Do not overheat your cartridge. Roval is nice and thick, but it most but in most cases, simply hitting the cartridge will heat it enough to allow the oil to move around. Using the preheat function is usually not necessary. When possible, store cartridge upright in its original Rove box. I wouldn't go as far as putting the bitch back in the box and keeping it upright, but I hate with a passion when my wife will just fucking lay her pen down like this, like on the table like this, like, bro, stand the motherfucker up. So when you go to grab it again, all your oil's in its place, ready to go. You don't have to wait for it to fucking leak back down the sides and get even again. Like it's it's a it's a crazy OCD pet peeve of mine. So when we're blast the wedding cake and then we'll see what the glue's hitting for. Again, if you got a pen, this is your standard pen. So most of them come with a dial at the bottom that you can turn up your voltage and turn down your voltage. I don't go higher than 3.8. I'm at 3.8 now. And it goes like there's in between numbers. Like it's a whole set of numbers. It's 3.3. Three. Well, I'll start at the beginning. What's the lowest? 3.3? Three, three? Yeah. So it goes 3.3, 3.4, 3.5, 3.6, 3.7, 3.8, 3.9, 3.10, 3.11, 3.12, 3.13, 3.14, 3.15, 3.16, 3.17, 3.18, 3.19, 3.20, 3.21, 3.
on top of him calling out Sharp and then apologizing to Sharp for not wanting beef with Sharp, but coming at Milk and, and still wanting to come at Milk. Like, Milk was just talking about the bullshit you was bitching about for the past two weeks about wanting to, to, to fade with Sharp. Like, niggas just be trying fucking tough guy motherfuckers because they color or, or whatever, but motherfuckers is real members. Motherfuckers is thorough and motherfuckers could really throw these. So, it ain't the motherfucking 70s and the 80s. Ain't nobody scared of black people no more, bro. That shit's been dead. I don't, I don't know if that's what they go off of or what. That's the only thing I could think of. Because other than that, why you coming in my color and, and, and according it to weakness? And then, of course, the Gunner situation. All right, Gunner might not have ratted on YSL, but I guarantee you he ratted on TSF. Shout out Sauce Walker. Ooh-wee. Splash. Shout out TSF, man. Y'all boys hold your head. That's what happens when you get too close. Stay with your gang or stay by yourself. I stay by myself. Can I perform this out? I highly recommend. Bro. Oh. Is a major fuck up. Rove Goo Hybrid. Strongly suggest. Come back to form attack.